Are there any other revenue benefits or return on investments that you've realized? Well, actually, yes. Turns out Hurricane Ike was a uh, was devastating to the Bolivar Peninsula, as your video shows. Um, the Texas Windstorm Insurance Association contacted us for historic data on houses that on ele for elevation certificates on houses that no longer exist. Through the GIS system, I can pull them up very quickly and very efficiently find out if we've done something, where it is, and I've already got it in a digital format that's ready to be sent to them. So you were able to sell them that data? Able to resell the data that we'd already captured. Wow. And they, there's nowhere else to get it. Wow. How many other survey companies are working in Galveston County? There's four or five. Surveyors. Out of, out of all of the, the other, let's say there's five other, uh, or a total of five companies working down here, mm -hmm. uh, all of them were probably contacted, but y'all were the only firm able to provide this data to the windstorm? That I'm aware of, yes, that I'm well, aware of. Obviously, you sold it to them. Right, ab absolutely. In, so in fact, the, if you look at the cost that it took that we invested in creation of the GIS, it's somewhere around $40,000 you know, with the, the employee that we brought in scanning and the, the minimal investment that we have in software and most of the, the coding and the, and the web page programming is, is done by Sid's son. So we, we pay him, but we don't, we don't pay him a lot. <laughs> <laughs> so the investment there of a total of about $40,000 in the creation of the GIS system from Texas Windstorm alone We've seen the recovery of approximately $35,000 of that $40,000 investment. They, they called us and said, we're looking for data. Do you right. have it? And just to be able to answer that question right. was, it was like, yeah, if, if we've done it, we still have it. You know, we didn't lose anything. It's already ready in a format ready for you. So I cut and paste out of our scan documents, stick it in an email, attach an invoice, and send it on. And they paid the bill. And they paid the bill. Um, we've located elevation certificates on 350 or 370, somewhere in there, properties that they're having problems, you know, because these people, they, they're not going to settle the claim until they have every bit of information they can get. And so there's people waiting on Windstorm, which Without the documentation, without the documentation, no they can't settle the right. claim. So right. we're really helping the public as well as the windstorm agency. Yeah, absolutely, right. absolutely. Awesome.